personally, I just started out as a graffiti artist. Uh, the whole feeling unappreciated, just trying to paint, walking a mile to go under a bridge, and you know, it's still illegal and all that. But after a while, you start seeing kids grow up and respect you, and you can't really show them a way they can paint without going to jail. You know, you start feeling bad, like you, you feel like you're setting them up for failure. And you paint live. I've seen you at Bar Basic. You're still at Bar Basic, or? Uh, no, no more Basic, but I was doing that for like three years. Uh, every week I was there painting live. Um, I was doing the uh, more Super Sundays in Hillcrest. I, I did that about, for like it's like an eight month thing I did. Um, yeah, just random spots, the Chi Chi, just little spots where they support art and you know they want that whole crowd going in there, having something to look at. Live painting a lot, like uh, on Broadway and just random spots. And then people want to get a hold of you. Is there a uh, MySpace or email? I'm so very hard to, buy to get stuff. a hold of. That's that's the catch. If you don't, if you're not in the art scene and you don't support and you don't come out, then you can't find me. I don't have business cards. I don't have, you know, I don't know. That's that's where I keep it. You know, if you don't come support, then you can't cool. buy my artwork. So I, you know, that's just me. That's cool. Cool. Uh, anything else? Um, love life and go Chargers. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. Cool. Yeah, sure. Ha <laughs> ha.